in today's video, we're going to be covering some of the most patriotic items to be able to start drop shipping for the 4th of July. The 4th of July or Independence Day is a massive holiday across the entire United States where people really start to show off their patriotism. Is that a word? Patriotism? Hold on. Yeah, it totally is. So patriotism is a word I was saying it correctly. So July 4th is a day off. Everyone gets together. Everyone gets with family, with friends. They have a barbecue. They have a little party, small get togethers. And at the end of the day, for the most part, a lot of people are either going to chill in their backyards or they're going to go out to a park or even the beach. So that way they can see pretty much what 4th of July is known for. And that's its fireworks. So what are some of the most trending items that people are going to be using on the 4th of July? Well, make sure you stick around all the way to the end of this video, because today I'm going to be giving you five of the most trending items to dropship for Independence Day. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. So kicking off today's list, the first item we're going to talk about is the most patriotic one that you can really start selling. And that is an American flag. Now for 4th of July, everyone's going to be having their flags flying. So because of that, this is the time that you need to start offering these for the people that don't have one. Now, the good thing about American flags is that for one, they can be sourced very cheaply and two, they can be sold at some pretty marked up prices, especially around certain holidays like the 4th of July. So check this out. So we can see that we can source our American flag through AliExpress. Now, this one actually has quite a few sales. They have over 500 sales with some pretty good reviews, 4.7 with 61 reviews. Now, this is a welcome deal for 99 cents, but you know, we don't mess with that. We like to go for the full price. So $3 and 14 cents with free shipping. As you can see, it's it's pretty cheap. And this is for the 90 by 150 centimeter. I think that was a five feet, a three by five foot long flag. Now let's check this out directly on Amazon, one of the biggest retailers literally ever and here we can see that it's running for twenty dollars and 98 cents now check this out so fourth of july is just a few months away and now is really when it's going to start picking up this is when people are going to start searching for most of these different types of items now check this out they're selling for twenty dollars and 98 cents with some pretty good reviews 4.6 stars twelve thousand reviews but this is what gets me over ten thousand of these have been sold in the last month Let's let's pull out a calculator really fast. Let's say at the low end, 10,000 times how much they're selling it for, $20.98. You ready for this? They have potentially made almost $210,000 in one month. Now, obviously, that's not including your expenses. So let's kind of figure out more or less how much they've actually made with a profit, not including fees, of course. So let's see here. Pull out another calculator because I'm not good at math at all. And we're going to do the price 3.14 times 10K, 31K. Subtract this. This is still going to be a massive amount. It's insane. $178,000 in a month. That's insane. Just off of selling flags. Imagine how much they're going to be selling around May or June, right before July 4th. It, it's just going to get insane. So jump in, get a slice of the pie before everyone else does. So I highly suggest you start offering this now. Now, one suggestion I'm going to give you is there's a lot of different types of flags that you can offer. So for one, you're going to have the basic American flag, but then you're also going to have some other ones like the black and blue ones, which are more for police officers and a few others. So do some research, see what different types of flags are being offered, which ones are trending and offer as many different variations as you can. Not just variations in the style, but also variations in the sizes because one like this is a three by five foot so it's pretty big but there are some smaller ones for people that don't have as big of a space for that so we already saw how much money the american flag can potentially make us but let's see how much it can make us per sale so as we saw it's twenty dollars and 98 cents to sell five dollars and 13 cents to source so each one of these after selling can make us about twelve dollars and 66 cents now, before we continue, as always, we have an easy to reference cheat sheet with all of the different links that I'm talking about in today's video. So if that interests you, make sure you go ahead and comment down below hashtag 4th of July dropshipping and let me know which one of these products was your favorite. Once I see that you went ahead and did that, I'll reply back with a link to the sheet. Now, the 4th of July, like I said, is a time where people are going to get together. They're going to be together in their backyards or at the park. And whenever people do this, whenever they get together in their little groups, a lot of the times, especially for 4th of July, there's going to be a barbecue. Now, with those barbecues, a huge traditional American staple, aside from the burgers, is going to be hot dogs. And that's where this next product comes in. Check this out. This is actually probably one of my favorite ones. 
It's like you're gonna have a mini 7-Eleven at your house. So you have the barbecue sausage grilling rack. Now this is just that. So you're gonna have a little rack where you're gonna put a few different sausages or a few different hot dogs and you're simply gonna cook it. Now this makes cooking hot dogs actually very efficient and very quick. So check out the TikTok ad really fast. Here what they're doing is they're just placing the hot dogs on the rack itself. And then they're gonna go ahead and grab it with the little handlebar and they're gonna show you how it's used. So just push forward, push back, and it's gonna roll the hot dogs. And of course with the fire, it's gonna be cooking them. Now this ad is, it's all right. I mean, it has almost 1800 likes, but it could be so much better if you literally just turned on the grill and showed people how it is actually being used. So that alone will make a huge difference and it'll create a lot more engagement. Now on Amazon, we can actually find the same one for $24.99. Now in the last month, over 50 have actually been purchased and it has some pretty good reviews, 4.1 stars. So the price for this is not bad, $25. Now, where can we source this and how much can we get it for? So over at the handpicked product section over at autods.com, we can find this same product, same color handlebar and everything for $10 dollars and 30 cents with a dollar 99 shipping now on social media it's starting to get some attention it's not overly saturated but it's starting to get some attention people are starting to sell it they're starting to make more content around it and other people are starting to interact with that content now how do i know this simply because i'm looking at the engagement score so for all of the different products that we have over in our handpicked product section at autods.com you're going to have access to tons of information but for one you're going to have access to an engagement score and a saturation score now this is important because this is gonna tell you whether or not a product is either oversaturated or if it's just getting started and there's tons of opportunity. Now this one in particular, it's at a mild. So a lot of the ones that we find are gonna be mild because they're already gonna have some attention behind them, but mild is not bad. That just means that there's some engagement, but it's not a massive amount. So there's still a lot of room before it starts to get oversaturated on social media. Now you can take advantage of this and jump in now and just start flooding with your own content. Order one of these to your house and start making content around it. That's the best way that you can start getting sales and you can market your products. Now, as far as the saturation score, on the saturation score, it's kind of busy. It's not just yet full market, but there's a few of these in the market. But again, it's not oversaturated just yet. So you can still jump in there and grab a slice of the pie or the hot dogs. Now looking at the engagement score and the saturation score, right? So this is one thing that I can decipher. There's not a lot of engagement on social media just yet, but there is starting to be somewhat of a market saturation on this. So what is this telling me? It's telling me that people are selling it, but they're not marketing it. So this is where you can come in and take advantage of this little empty spot. The spot where people are just simply not marketing this on social media. So you're gonna find maybe one, two people, three, four, five people posting about it. It's it, it's gonna start growing, but not just yet. So I suggest you get in there, find products, if not this one, a few other ones that are somewhat in the lower engagement score and just start trying to take over with your own content. Now, as far as our profit, how much can we make by selling just one of these? So selling one at $24.99, sourcing it at $12.29 gives us a potential profit of $12.70. All right, next up we have 4th of July t-shirts. Now you don't have to buy your t-shirts from AliExpress and sell them already printed that way. What you can do is you can actually create your own designs and sell them through print on demand through the AutoDS print on demand section. Now, one of these shirts can be sold easily for 22 to about $27 on the high end, sometimes 30 to 35, but that's really if you have your marketing dialed in correctly and you already have some social proof. But if you don't, you can easily sell your shirts between 22 to about 25 or $27. Now, this shirt in particular is actually selling for $22.98. So let's check this out really fast. So this is on Etsy and this one, as you can see, this one is actually doing really, really good. It has 19 reviews just for this one product, but the shop itself has over 6,000 reviews. So this, these people know what they're doing. Now, <laughs> the shirt itself is awesome. Ben Drangen. This is another classic American staple, 4th of July. People like to drink. People drink on 4th of July and they like to get pretty messed up. And shirts like this just make the time a lot better. It makes everything just a lot more fun. Oh my God, you are so drunk. Now to source this, we can actually, like I said, get it through our print on demand section at AutoDS. 
So here we can go ahead and click on print on demand once we're logged in and choose whatever product we want. Do we want to print a hoodie? Do we want to print a tank top? Do we want to print something for kids? I don't think you want to print something for kids that says been drinking. Maybe you can do been drinking and just have them hold like, I don't know, like a milk bottle. But that means you're going to have to get these designs created. More on that in just a second. Now, to get started, let's just go ahead and choose any basic t-shirt. Let's choose this one right here. The unisex t-shirt. This is on the lower end at $7.25. So let's go ahead and choose a color for us let's do navy and i'm a big guy so i'm gonna do 2xl and edit product so now here what we need to do is we need to upload our design but how are we going to get a design now there's a few different ways you can do this you can do this either using ai with kittle kittle is probably my favorite ai design software it's absolutely amazing their ai is super easy to use but it does require a paid subscription now the other option you have is simply to go on etsy and look for fourth of july png now i write png because i always like to have png files which means you don't have a background on them now on Etsy, you can find all of these different products over here, all of these different designs. You can simply just purchase any one of these and then upload it through here. Now I don't have a 4th of July one just yet, so I'm just gonna go ahead and upload any random design and we could just pretend that it's 4th of July. But there we have that. Just go ahead and click on save. And that's pretty much all there's to it. This item is now going to go to our draft section where we can go ahead and optimize the title, the price and all that stuff before making it go live on our store. So this is how you can start doing some t-shirts, hoodies and other print on demand items for 4th of July. And I'm telling you that these sell really, really well. Now, I'm going to let you in on a little secret when it comes to these types of products, right? When it comes to political products, because that's what these are. Since it's 4th of July, everyone likes to express, like I said, their patriotism. So things can get very political. But when things get very political, that means there's a lot of heat and there's a lot of attention to it. But a lot of people also get very passionate about it. So if you can make somewhat controversial shirts, specifically targeting the election that's coming up this year, then you potentially have some best sellers on your hands. Because like I said, people like to express themselves. People like to purchase t-shirts. And when it comes to the elections, people have very strong feelings. Now, to get started, one of these sells for about $22.98. That's what we're going to go with. And the sourcing price in total with shipping and handling comes up to about $12.74. So each one of these is going to sell and give us a profit of about $10.24. All right, up next on number four, we have Independence Day decorations. Now, this unfortunately is going to vary. This isn't something that I can necessarily put a price point on because there's just too many to actually count. But when it comes to the 4th of July, people like to decorate. And again, people like to express their patriotism. I'm just going to keep saying patriotism since I found that it was a word that I got correct. So just get used to it. Now, like I said, everything here varies because it's really all going to depend on the type of decorations that you're going to be selling and how many sets you're going to be selling them in. Sometimes you can sell bundles. Sometimes you're going to sell them separately. So let's take a quick look. So on AliExpress, simply looking up 4th of July decorations is going to come up with tons of different products. So they have things like these little flags. These are super popular. You see them everywhere. You of course have balloons. Everyone's going to have balloons, especially if there's kids around. You have these little table stands. You have these banners for the side of your house. Of course, you have tablecloths. Everyone's going to be buying these. So really at this point, it's kind of up to you to start putting together a bunch of these different ones. And and start coming up with different sets. So come up with a few that are going to include, let's say, these little banners, maybe some of these streamers and some balloons. Then make a size B, right? So size B is going to have these right here, these bigger banners, maybe some pillows and everything that size A includes. Then you can create something like a package C that's going to include what A and B both have, along with, let's say, these utensils with plates and cups or this little reef right here, just things like that. So get creative, sell these all individually, but then also sell them as sets. So this is something that is going to take a little bit extra work, but at the end of the day, it's really going to be worth it because you're going to make it easier for the customer to make a decision on which one they're going to purchase because you're already going to have the sets ready for them to take advantage of. So aside from that, let's go ahead and run over to Etsy and let's see what people are selling on here. So you can see that a lot of the same decorations are also being sold on here. If not the same, very similar. And a lot of these are going for just a lot more. So let's see something similar. So you have these wooden decorations right here, these wooden signs, and those are somewhat similar to these right here. These are tiered trays. Now these are running for about $7 and each of these are running for about $2 with $3 shipping. Now, of course, this is actually for the smaller one. So if you go for the bigger one, which is gonna be closer to the size of these over here, you're going to be spending a bit more money. So you're already at $16 instead. Now choose your design 
And are they offering free shipping? Let's see, $4 shipping. So on top of that, you're still paying for shipping. So as you can see, all of these same products are being resold on Etsy or similar products are being resold on Etsy at a pretty big marked up price. You got a reef over here that's going for over $154. Wow, that's insane. Well, we have the reef on this side that is a bit more colorful, actually. It's a bit also more artificial since it's all ribbons, but still it gets the point across. God bless America. And it's just full of red, white, and blue, $9 and 66 cents. Or if you go for the full price, $22 and 46 cents. So it, it, that's a pretty massive markup. And last but not least at number five, we have another one that really does vary. And this one's gonna be games. Now, like I said, people get together and everyone's gonna be playing games, especially if there's kids involved. Now, when it comes to this, the types of games are also gonna vary. So the price ranges are gonna vary, but so are the types of games. Now, overall, as a niche, games sells really well, especially for events or for things like, like this, like 4th of July for holidays. Now, if you just look up games, you're gonna have tons of different games that you can choose from. So what type of games are you actually gonna be selling for the 4th of July? Well, there's gonna be a few specific ones. For one, primarily, it's gonna be mainly games that can be played in a pool. A lot of people are have pools. A lot of people are gonna celebrate with a pool party for 4th of July. So pretty much anything that you can have in a pool is gonna do fairly well, especially something like these. These summer pool drink holders do very well because you can just have your drink right in front of you in the pool and not have to worry about it spilling. Aside from that, games like Cornhole do absolutely amazing as well because these are games that are enjoyed in the family. And if you can find one that's themed for the 4th of July or that's themed for Patriots, even better. It's gonna match the holiday perfectly. Aside from that, you also have games like Horseshoe, which are very popular amongst kids. So anything that you can play in a family or amongst friends, maybe even in a smaller group, especially since some people might even be playing these when they go out to, let's say the park, when they're gonna go see the fireworks. So overall, the game niche for something like 4th of July or for holidays overall, it's a great selling niche. It's one of the better selling niches because again, it helps bring people together and just enjoy their time together. Now, I know this video was a little bit shorter, if not about half as short as some of the other products videos that we had, but because I decided to go with two niches instead of two specific products, I figured that you would have a bit more to be able to choose from. So if you enjoyed this video, please make sure you smash that like button, hit that subscribe button and ring that little bell notification. And remember, if you want access to the cheat sheet, just go ahead and drop a comment down below with the hashtag 4th of July dropshipping and let me know which one of these products was your favorite. Huge thank you once again to everyone for watching. My name is Mario with AutoDS and I'll catch you all next time.